hope. Our last hope is Jewel. As I eat this pastrami for Jewel, Papa Bless, let's get in there to grand finals here. Jewel versus Nelvin. I don't think anyone saw this coming, but should be. It was an entertaining set back in winners? No, winners finals? No, losers. What was it? It was winners semis, I think, these two last played. Uh-huh. And it was indeed an entertaining set. But I'm curious to see, like, what's going to change now. Nelvin, he's got some wind beneath his wings. He's chilling here with winner side grants, so he's got a set to play around with. And then, of course, Jewel coming off two really hot sets, getting himself up here. Even with, even with Del playing Rob now, we still cannot escape Diddy in top three of Zeno. So, that's how it be. But yeah, Jewel's item play was really, really great last time these two played, but Nelvin was just able to adapt and stage Jewel's face. I'd love to see what uh, changes these two can make. The change is heavy mesh. It's just going to be a battle of how long Jewel can hold his stock and keep tacking on damage onto Nelvin, because Nelvin has shown that he's able to finish his food and close out his stocks pretty consistently. Yo, I love this song. I hope no one switches the song. Oh, God, look at this flurry of stuff that's just going at Melvin right now. Flurry of stuff. Like, you just ate 40% <laughs> from just getting hit by random things. Could have gone for F smash, but I'm just for down smash, I guess. I think they both have similar frame startups, so I don't know why. But anyway, going to be nailing that stock off the top right there, yeah. This is just going to be a, a slog to see if Jewel can keep Melvin out and if Melvin can get in. Because you're not really going to be see. Did he slip on the banana twice? Yes, he did. Unfortunate. It was something that can happen. It's so dumb. <laughs> oh well. I'm sure Nelvin's happy about it. He hasn't been able to get too much off. Of him, though. All right, though. Jewel been able to catch all of these monkey flips except for that one. Yeah, he lost his Levin blade as he went in for that interaction. And the hitbox for the Nair when it's the broadsword is not nearly as. Nice. I also like Nelvin's awareness to not get locked down by the arc fire and rather just jump, at, uh, roll out of there since it's going to go sour. He knows Jewel's able to get pretty much guaranteed follow-ups off of it. It's not the greatest special move. Arc fire is actually pretty bad on, on shield. On ledge, it's a beast. But on shield, it's kind of meh. Most of the projectiles that Robin has outside of uh, Alpha, though, Whoa. are actually pretty mediocre. It's just that Joel has a very good sense of decision making, so he knows when to use which ones. And on top of that, he knows exactly how he can follow up the contact that's made for all of them. Nelvin has seemed to find his way around Jewel's shield trapping almost immediately. You usually see players struggle with it to do it for a while, but Nelvin had the proper knowledge just in between the the arc fires to choose burial. So, so Jewel's going to have to catch on that and kind of mix them up, as he just attempted to with the same option. The no mix-up, mix-up. Mix-up, mix-up. Nelvin has been playing this really, really well. It seems like he's, he's showed no shortage of just re-adapting to the matchup. He's going to be dead from that. Yeah, the ledge that deep at the ledge with that much damage. Yeah. He's also just been locking down Jewel. Oh, gets the sour spot of that back here. Very unfortunate for Jewel. I feel like Jewel should retreat to do it. Yeah, those thunders once again. I feel like Arcfire has just been way too committal for him this set, and he hasn't been able to get anything off of it. Oh, that was cute. He used the hit of banana to end out his end line. The hit stun wasn't, a, wasn't as much. A little place like that. I like it. It's, it's a little things, man. Jewel has been run, getting run it on by Nelvin, though. Ne Nelvin not been able to do any more damage, but Jewel's not been able to finish his food. As I say that, though, getting the, uh, what is that? El Thunder El Thunder, yeah. All right, bet. I mean, El Thunder, think of, like, Wolf Blaster, but at the speed of Fox News. I love Nelvin not rolling through that. It said opting to jump over it. If you roll through it, he would have been caught by the, uh, the jab once again. And that's going to be it for game one. Yeah. Nelvin is one game away from winning his very first Xeno. That's yeah. going to be insane. I, and Nelvin's not even like the best player from CT either. Yo, new champion? New champion. Now, I don't think Nelvin's even ranked in CT. He isn't. If he does win, new it'll champion. be before midnight. Let's go, Nelvin. It's 11.55. You know what? Nah, we freedom, boys. Let's go, Jewel. No. Let freedom ring, baby. See, I work for the Redcoats. <laughs> All comes full circle. Oh, I love their football team. <laughs> There's layers to the stupid that just came out of your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> All right, though, we're going to see if Jewel can rain Let's it go back Nelvin. in. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Boy, mate, right. you hit a banana here? 
the hopes and dreams of all Americans ride with this game. This is and actually. The next one for Jewel. You have Evil Nelson. I think it's say Evil three Nelson. <laughs> I just want to point out that Nevin has an American flag on his shirt right now. Because so. that's what he's trying to claim. He's trying to take it away from us. <laughs> he's already taking it from us. It's on his shirt. It's like capture the flag. Jewel's trying to get that back. Clap your hands. What can Jewel oh do? Oh, my God. Wow, Jewel really couldn't do anything there. That's wild. I, I refuse to believe that Downtown consistently will catch every option from Ledge. In Jewel's defense, how much experience does he have in this matchup? We don't have any real. ditties in New York because the only one we had went back to his brawl me. To be fair, Rob is much better than Diddy Dog. Yeah, but not tonight. And Jewel now struggling to find anything in Melvin, kind of doing so much work with this banana right here. Like, while I understand that Jewel can be confident on this stage, let's not forget that this is a fantastic stage historically for Diddy Dog. Like, when majority of the battle is protect a platform and then guard the ledge, two things that Diddy is really good at, it shouldn't be a surprise to us that Nelvin's going to be able to contest for stage control very easily. Yo, Nelvin's been looking so comfortable now on the up. Usually people would be mad nervous when they're about to win a Xeno, but Nelvin's showing the, the proper intuition, keep mixing up his options. He's been uh, tripping Jewel up with these random barrels in neutral, mixing up the timings of him throwing banana. Wow, I, I, if Arc Thunder killed, I would have been like, wow. Can you fake throw something? Ooh, catching with the last hit of uh, Thoron. Thoron, yeah, that's what I was going to say. The big one is Thoron. The big one. I have Smash again. Yeah, these landings have been very tricky for Jewel as Nelvin has just been placing the banana close enough, and he's been punishing these arc fires so well. Luckily, Jewel is trading, so it's not like he's getting too destroyed by them, but he's got to be very careful with these. Yeah, I like the low, low committal is what he should be doing when he's on a deficit, for sure. The problem is that Robin doesn't have many low committal options. Like, Thunder's very quick, it's very safe, and, like, down tilt exists. But those two moves are not a character make. Jewel. Notice Jewel there opted to throw the banana away instead of use it. I think he's realized that Nelvin has now been able to regain his item play. And Jewel, so don't you dare slow slowing this down. <laughs> he's slowing it down, man. Trent hey, letting freedom ring! Head. The zoning war to end all zoning wars. The top half of this bracket has literally been a zoning war, despite Mr. V. All right, Nelvin, one stock away from winning Xeno. 168. That's Slightly crazy. More than a minute. Will we be freedom, boys? Yo, if Nelvin wins this before July 4th, that would be a feat of its own. We'd literally have a minute and a half left on the clock before it's July 4th. <laughs> They're both oh, no, this could be it. They're both throwing themselves off stage. It's like those bets, like, would you fight a uh, UFC fighter in the ring for uh, for a minute if you could get, like, $5 million or something like that? <gasps> that could be it, though. Just living barely. He's alive. Oh, no. Okay. Jewel has to be so careful. Well, literally one up smash through, uh, through platform will end it. But he gets the back air, which is one thing we know about Jewel. He's super duper clutch. Less than a minute left seconds. on the clack. Oh no, that could be it! Ah! Oh, it is with the air dodge, and just like that, Nelvin is our new champion of Xeno. Oh, going to the full dap up. I appreciate that. And Xeno has ended before midnight. Damn it. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. Damn it. Just give the whole America back to the Brits. Can I interview Nelvin? Uh, no, we probably should just like right. head out of here. I, I want to get food. You don't want to give him yeah. his freedom, huh? Just uh, you he got his freedom. Devin he, definitely just wants to end the stream. He got 12. more important than his freedom. He got my, first place winners. I need to do the outro. So guys, if you did enjoy both of our commentaries, um, follow I'd him be at very Hangman surprised if you Twelve. Did. If you enjoyed hearing me eat pastrami on stream, you can follow me at FAN, Yo, FAN9S. Shout out to Nixie, who is like, Devin, I'm going to the deli. Uh, <laughs> do you want anything? Of course, After two Nick weeks of me saying no, and then I'm just like, you know what? Let me get a half pound of pastrami. Only Nick would be the chaotic force to bring deli meats onto the stream. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah. Do we have any more meat, by the way? No, it was only right. a half pound. Should have so done a I'm full a, pound. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten since like 7.30 this morning. I had some pastrami um, just now. Pretty good. <laughs> I need I need food of some type. Maybe not meat. Maybe meat. We'll find out. 